It's a big ask for a bird that can't fly, standing less than half a meter tall. But it's now that rock hoppers live up to their name. Incredibly strong toenails grip the rock. The beak makes a good climbing tool. The more experienced penguins make it look easy, but it's a steep learning curve. It takes youngsters a while to get the hang of it. Misjudge it, and it's back to square one. Top of the cliff, the going gets a little easier. It's his turn to feed, so he leaves her to look after their eggs. Now she must tackle a problem faced by no other kind of penguin. For the next 10 days, she must protect her eggs from the African sun. A dense coat of feathers that keeps her warm in cold seas now stifles her. On these exposed rocks, she must shade her eggs instead of keeping them warm. Everything here seems the wrong way round. For some, the soaring temperature is too much. A neighbor deserts his nest. His egg will not survive. He's not the only one to give up. Some years, not a single chick is reared. Penguins are adapted to withstand temperatures of 40 degrees below zero, not 40 degrees above. Now, at the hottest part of the day, the very worst time, her chicks are hatching. Thousands of rock hoppers make this journey each day, and the headland has attracted an unwelcome visitor. Huge male sea lion, a hundred times their size. Tossed around, the tiny birds do their best to avoid him.
Each attack is a loss that will affect a whole family. sees her chick for the first time. She's keen to start parenting, but the father needs persuading to surrender the chick he's been caring for all winter. He must now put his chick at risk. In these temperatures, it could freeze in seconds. the male will have to let go. Eventually, the transfer to the mother is safely made. The chicks grow quickly on a diet of fish and squid. Soon, they're keen to explore, but always with mother in tow. This chick is less fortunate. Its mother has not returned to claim it. Another orphan is searching for a new family, but this female already has a chick of her own. Some orphans receive too much mothering from penguins whose own chicks have not survived. The urge to parent is so strong that they will compete with one another to adopt any chick they find. Many of these squabbles end in tragedy, as the poor chick is trampled to death. Those chicks that do have parents quickly learn survival skills. Even in spring, they must huddle together for warmth, just as their fathers did in the depths of winter. A group of chicks has got lost in the blizzard. Cold and disorientated, they search for the colony. It will not be long before the storm claims its first victims. By early summer, the chicks are surprisingly well developed and now look ready to take on the world. Those that survive their first year have the best possible start in life, thanks to the extraordinary hardships endured by their parents. Parents who battled with the Antarctic winter and won.